Hello friends, meet Artemisia vulgaris, mugwort. Vulgaris is because it's a common plant. Artemisia is from Artemis, the Greek moon goddess who was the patron of women, maiden, mother, and crone. Mugwort is also called cronewort. Mugwort's in the Asteraceae family and a perennial that grows everywhere. Culpepper decided that mugwort was ruled by Venus, but I think she's a moon plant. In traditional Chinese medicine, as well as Ayurveda, mugwort is recognized for addressing women's reproductive issues throughout all the phases, such as puberty, childbirth, as well as menopausal issues. Mugwort is very helpful for bringing on delayed menses. Mugwort is a warming, aromatic, bitter, so it's really great in aiding the digestive process and tonifying to the liver. Its aromatic quality makes it an excellent carminative as well. It's very calming and it brings ideas to focus. Mugwort is a nervine as well. Mugwort can draw out our innate wisdom, provide us with inspiration as well as guidance. It's antithelmintic, but gentle. Um, it's wonderful internally or as a wash, externally on funguses and the like. Not as strong as Artemisia absinthium or Artemisia annua, though. Pliny, who was a first century herbalist, would carry mugwort as a protective amulet, and he said it, it would ward off evil. St. John the Baptist also supposedly carried mugwort into the wilderness to ward off evil. Mugwort is a very popular food in Japanese, Indian, Chinese uh, cuisine. I make a very delicious herbal vinegar with mugwort. It's very nourishing indeed. Mugwort is also very popular as an herbal ally that can enhance dreaming, often put into dream pillows to encourage lucid dreaming, and often used in scrying or other forms of divination, either as a tea, a wash, or a smudge. Here we put mugwort um, in our ritual, our new moon ritual, and our prayer for the earth. We sat the earth in a bed of mugwort leaves. Burning mugwort as a smudge is a very cleansing, um, in cleansing rituals. It's very um, beautiful smelling. Its cousin is Artemisia tridentata, which is sagebrush. We make um, mugwort smudges with lavender in them. And we dry them and we burn them. Um, and they also burned in traditional Chinese um, medicine in acupuncture as moxa sticks. So that's an integral part of acupuncture to stimulate the meridians. I encourage you to go out and meet this amazingly magical plant and see how she inspires you. Thank you.